Okie doke, so if you've made it this far, welcome to Star Citizen 335. Um, this is the main menu. So I'm g quickly going to give you a tour of uh, all of the various menu options and what the game sections do on all of these pretty buttons are. So starting off with uh, the universe section, this is where you'll probably be spending most of your time because this is where the actual Star Citizen Persistent Universe is located. So if you hit this button here, first off it's going to take you to the character creator. I'll spend a second or two quickly showing you what this works like. You pick a face and a skin tone and a hairstyle and a hair color and an eye color. What gives you the idea? I've done this a couple of times. You can swing this guy around a bit to see whether or not he looks good from all angles and then accept and that'll give you your character that you can play with in the persistent universe so currently you've got two options under universe you can go to your hangar uh, the options you see will depend on the game package that you've purchased or in the free fly you'll probably get a lot of options over here because you'll be um, presented with lots of different ships to play with but uh, so the hangar is literally what it says is just an empty hangar where you can walk around and try out a few things, spawn some ships, see what they look like, but you can't actually go anywhere. The game itself is located over here, so this is the Stanton system, which is the current playable area. And if you hit this button, you'll be presented with the option to load into a particular server. Um, I generally connect to the European servers because that's the closest to us uh, location wise so in terms of latency they tend to perform the best but um, the USA sometimes works well especially if Europe is a little bit busy um, Oz the latency is on the high side so you can try it out um, I don't necessarily recommend that as the best option but play around with it and see what, what works for you otherwise you can just hit the best button and that uh, it might work as well so let's just go back to the main menu again we're not going to load into the game just yet over here is your contact list so if you've got a list of friends that you've added uh, to your contact list you can add people in game as well you this list will be here and this will also show you which of your contacts are currently online and playing the game and from that from here on you can then uh, start a party and jump into the game together which we're not going to do right now for the rest of the main menu, uh, Star Marine is a FPS uh, module, a shooter where you can run around on enclosed levels and play first person shooter against some other folks. I'm not going to show you what that works like right now. This is very basic so I would suggest you get your FPS action in the universe section rather. But feel free to try this out. Arena Commander might be very useful. Um, this gives you various options to fly spaceships also in a small enclosed level either against AI um, uh, bots or against other people and even just by yourself so if you're learning to fly and you're not yet familiar with how the game works I highly suggest you try Arena Commander in free flight mode so let me quickly show you that one just so you get an idea of what's going on so you can go to single player mode and then you can pick out of all the game modes free flight and you've got a choice of two maps either broken moon or dying star doesn't really matter they just look a bit different but functionally they're the same you've also got the option now of selecting or renting ships and then you can launch into that level and play with your controls become familiar with how the ships fly etc so that's useful for learning the basics Alright, so once you feel comfortable with how your ship handles, or maybe you're just feeling adventurous, feel free to jump into universe and try it out. The last thing of course down here is the options menu, uh, which has a lot of different things going on in it, and I'll show you what this works like in a subsequent video. Cheers for now!